Welcome to another Save My Butt tutorial. My name is Mike DeMichael. The tutorial title is How to Uninstall a Vast Antivirus. Inside this video, I'm going to teach you how to remove a vast antivirus using the control panel. In Windows 7 and Windows Vista, it's called Programs and Features in the control panel. And in Windows XP, it's called Add Remove Programs. Why remove your antivirus, you might ask? Version 5 of Avast is bloatware. By definition, bloatware is a software package that tries to do everything for you. It's a suite of smaller packages that tries to be... Actually, it doesn't try anything. It is your antivirus. It's your firewall. It's your spam filter. It's your anti-spyware, anti-malware software and on machines particularly machines that are older than two three or four years old uh, maybe even underpowered machines it tends to slow them down a lot sometimes to a crawl it's complicated to register the free version lots of people go up to the website to register the free version and by accident register for the paid version and end up paying for the free version it's complicated to use. Sometimes you want to manually do an update, manually do a scan, maybe find the files that are in the quarantine, and it's difficult to use. So step by step, we're going to remove a vast antivirus, and then we're going to reboot your computer. So if you're ready, I am, let's get started. Now we're going to remove a vast antivirus from your computer. I'm using Windows 7 here today. Uh, the procedures in Windows Vista are the same as they are on Windows 7. Windows XP is slightly different, and I will give you the tips for Windows XP as we get to where those uh, differences are. The first thing we want to do is we want to open the control panel. And we do that by going down here to the lower left corner and clicking on the Start button. In Windows Vista and Windows 7, you click on Control Panel. In Windows XP, you would click on Settings and then Control Panel. Once you get the Control Panel open, again, in Windows Vista and Windows 7, we would click on Uninstall a Program. In Windows XP, depending upon the look your, your, your settings are set at for the Control Panel, you would either click on Add Remove Programs or you would uh, uh, click on Programs and then Uninstall just like you would here. So let's go ahead and click on this. We're now presented with a dialog box that lists all the software that's in our, in our computer. We want to highlight a vast antivirus. In Windows XP, to the right of it, over here, there'll be a button that says Remove. And Vista and Windows 7, we just click Uninstall at the top. When the Avast Antivirus Setup screen opens, we want to click the Uninstall icon and then click Next, and the uninstall process will begin. When it's finished, it's going to ask us to restart our computer. You need to restart your computer before you install a new antivirus program. Uh, I like to uh, click restart later and then finish and close everything out and then go down to the start button again and then click shut down and then restart to restart your computer. Thank you for viewing this tutorial. I hope it was helpful to you. I look forward to seeing you in the next tutorial.